And we're live on Twitch once again. Impromptu Twitch stream. It's not part of the plan, but I decided why not do a little stream this evening. I had nothing better to do, so here we are. So this evening, I'm just going to do a little bit of terraforming, underwater terraforming around the island. So hopefully you're down for a chill stream of me just terraforming underwater. Which is really what any duck would do, wouldn't it? Yes, indeed. Let's see if we can raise this music up a little bit. Pinky Bear and Hyper Jimbo in the Twitch chat. Hello. Welcome to the stream. How are you doing, Pinky? How am I doing? I'm doing great. We're just going to go ahead and do a little bit of terraforming underwater. Let me just double check one thing quick. Right. Um, okay. Concerned Llama in chat. How's it going? It's going good. Just started getting ready to do a little bit of underwater terraforming around my island on the Let's Play Minecraft Together server. Thank you for joining us. Let's get started. Right. Um, okay, so we need to bring this down. Right here. How you doing, Concerned Llama? Hopefully you're not too concerned. Would hate for you to be concerned all the time. Let 
Well, one thing we got to make sure we're doing here is just adding a little bit of variation. We wouldn't want this to become a little too monotonous, would we? Repetitive? No thank you. Jimbo says, this is a surprise stream. Yes, it is. It is indeed. Surprised you to the core, I can tell. Um, yeah, whoops, that's fine. But I'm gonna go ahead and reclaim this. This is my sand block. Whoops, that's not great. Pyroburnum says, watching three people streaming on LPMT at the same time. It is that time of the week, isn't it? You get to the, the midweeks, the midweek point, and that's when everybody starts streaming. And X with a surprise visit on the Let's Play Minecraft together doing a bit of base touring was nice. Good for him to come on every now and then and see what everybody's been up to as much as we see what people are up to on a daily basis playing together on this server. Yes. Concerned Llama says, Today is one of those days where it's hard to deal with depression, but I'm trying to chill a bit. Well, I'm sorry to hear that you're having a bit of a depressed day. Hopefully you can get into some uh, underwater terraforming with us and hopefully you have a chill time with us. That would be cool. How's your day going today, Pyro Burnham? Midweek crisis? Bear says, sorry I missed the last stream. I was really busy, and by the time I was able to jump in and say hi, you were already... Oh, you had already ended. I wish I could have been there, though. That's perfectly fine. You know what? Everybody has a life. I stream a couple times a week, so you know. Catch it when you can, and when you can't, don't even worry about it. This music is too loud. Concerned Llama wants to know, what's the idea behind this project? Well, I decided to settle in an island, on an island rather, and uh, it was much, much smaller than it is now, and this one that I'm standing on currently didn't actually exist, so I actually had to form this one myself. Um, and so I didn't want everything to be a dirt platform, so, you know, gotta make it look like it belongs. Connecting it to the seabed and all that. Hmm. Oh dear. Oh my goodness. We're out of sand. Unbelievable. Can you believe it? Power Burnham says, cleaning up some work in the Christmas village. Oh dear. You're working in the Christmas village, getting it ready for next Christmas. That seems like a good place for that one. Right. Whoops. Whoopsies. Oh, just dropping sand everywhere. So yeah, there was a bit of a small island here, actually. I kind of lied before. But anyways, I had an idea as well to drain all the water out from underneath the island. 
That's going to be kind of tedious. But it looks cool. So if we actually find the entrance here, which there is one over here, we can take a look at what it looks like on the inside. So my plan, once I'm done filling in all the, the terraforming, to come in here, drain all the water out, carve away all the land that's still sticking out, and uh, just make a big, huge, massive mess of the place. Jimbo's suggesting using some gravel instead of just sand everywhere. Yeah, I'm going to come through and, and uh, eventually, not now, because I'm just doing the, the easy part first. Well, easy yet still tedious, but you know. We'll do the easy part first, placing the sand, getting the shape, and then come through and add some of this gravel texture. So don't you even worry about it. We'll get to that. Oh yeah. Pinky Bear says you're really good at terraforming. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you ever so much. Never have really considered myself to be a terraforming player necessarily, but this with this kind of terraforming, I feel like you gotta make it up as you go. Cause something like this, there's no right or wrong way to do it. It sort of just comes down to you know, what's the story you're telling, I guess, with the currents? Because with terraforming underwater like this, you got to be able to, I guess, somewhat tell a story about how the water has behaved over the years. Because you wouldn't want flat walls going straight down. That just wouldn't make a lot of sense. No, it would not. Jimbo, are you on the server today? That's what I want to know. Oh yeah, still impersonating I Louvre Cats, by the way, one of the moderators on the server. We should go with that. We'll be we'll be Binky today. I feel like this music needs to chill out a little bit. Like it has now. We've got a nice chill song on now. I've turned it down a couple times. Uh oh. What happened there? Glitchy box. Box? Blocks. Blocks! Glitchy blocks be glitchy. Okay. Pyro Burnham says, oh, whoa, X rate incoming. Potentially, I guess that's always an option when uh, X raids or when uh, X is finishing his stream when I've just started mine. <laughs> Pinky Bear says, is X going to raid again? I have no idea. Who knows? Who knows? 
Garth Spangle, Real Fally, welcome to the Twitch, to the Twitchies, the Binky Twitchies. What? That's a strange thing to say, isn't it? What a strange thing to say, indeed. Oh, yep. I guess you guys called it. There it is. The Asuma raid, once again. Hello, Asuma, and hello, Asuma's uh, wonderful, beautiful viewers. Welcome to my stream. Saw the tail end of you touring my base earlier, X. So that was a lovely surprise. Welcome, welcome, everybody. Decided to do a bit of a chill stream today, doing some underwater terraforming. Welcome, Metamorphic Mike, to the stream. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Whoops. I spent all of my last stream impersonating I Louvre cats. Maybe I'll just continue the tradition. Hey, Wrist and Shade0124. I think you're missing a three there, my friend. With the follows. Thank you very much for following, and I hope you enjoy the stream this evening. Doing some underwater terraforming. No, oh, that didn't quite work, did it? Let's just ignore that. Spangleboo says, I spy a teehee. Do you spy a teehee? Spangle with the teehee. You know, always up to no good with those teehees. How's everybody doing? How was X's stream? I caught the tail end of it the last 30 minutes before I decided to get live on Twitch. Doing a bit of base touring and checking out some uh, some players' bases on the server, so that was really cool to see. Welcome again to the Binky Quack stream. We got follows! We got follow noises! Double Moses! has followed. Thank you very much for the follow, my friend, and I hope you are having a good evening. Finor Rear has also followed, as well as the Seref Project. Welcome, welcome. Thank you very much for the follows. And thank you for hanging out with us. Hmm. Right there seems about right. Steno says, could do a pop-out chat. Um, whereabouts do you suppose that would be? I have it on my second monitor. Double Moses says, it's six in the morning here. My goodness. That's too early. Right, let's step back. Just a second, see how things are going here. Shade0124 in chat wants to know, what am I building? Well, I'm just connecting the floating dirt platforms that are currently my island. I'm connecting those to the bottom of the ocean. Uh, 
Oh, goodness me. Nope. Nope. Don't like that. Hyper Jimbo says, Quack's family. Yes, welcome to the Quack family. Welcome to all the new followers. And speaking of followers, we got another one. AJ Pines1 has followed. Thank you very much for the follow. Hope you're having a wonderful evening. Or day. Or morning. You know. It's not 8.15 p.m. everywhere, right? Maybe we should, yeah, we should connect it up to this bit here. Good enough. I like it. Oh, wow. Okay, watch me butcher this one. Quace Gaming XX has followed. Nice. Thank you very much. Welcome to the Quack family. Let me know if I butchered that. Probably as bad, if not worse, than X at pronouncing usernames on this game. Jimmy. Jimmy says hi. Hello. Welcome to my stream. Hope you're having a good evening. Again, it's not exclusively evening for everyone, but hi, have a good evening. Whenever it's evening for you. Sedge R4 has followed as well. All these follow noises, man, can't keep up, can we? Thank you very much for the follow. Hope you had a wonderful time with X streaming earlier. Giving you some tours of some bases on the Let's Play Minecraft Together server. Quace Gaming says, you can call me PG, and yes, you both did. Yes, we both probably butchered that one pretty big. Yes, indeed. OG, right. Call him OG. Call them OG, sorry. You heard it. They are the OG. Shade wants to know, is X bad with names? Well, I don't know, chat. How, how good is Asuma with names? Charlie Panda is hosting with uh, one Vera. Well, one is better than none, so thank you very much for hosting. Hoping you're having a wonderful day. Just hanging out here on the Let's Play Minecraft Together server. Trying to do a bit of underwater terraforming. Oh, 
we've run out of dirt. No, we haven't. We're all good. Uh, one more. Yeah. One more, one more, one more. Spangle Blue says he is great at saying Spangle. Well trained. Yes, indeed. But who was I trained by? Yeah. Charlie Panda says still funny watching people fail at the last bit of my name. Well, is it not Charlie Panda? Get out of here, no one invited you to the party. All right. If I look like I'm derping about, it's because I'm reading the chat. I'm trying to keep up with that. Ace3473 is asking about the minimap. How how do you add the minimap? This minimap is a client-side mod that I'm using called Voxel Map. And it requires the Rift mod loader. So if you get that and you get Voxel Map, you'll be good to go. Pinky Bear says, people being bad with my name is the reason why I made my name so simple. I think I added a few words to that, but the point is the same. Well, I can say I definitely appreciate the simplicity in your username. It certainly makes my life easier. Although, really, at the end of the day, if I've said somebody's name wrong, it just is what it is. I'm not going to stress. Ace says thanks. You are welcome. You should thank the mod developers. Maybe it is a little bit cheaty to use a thing like this, but hey, I'm not too worried about it. You probably wouldn't see something like that on the Hermitcraft server. Hello, Jimbo. Repping the duck banners. Duck pride. Oh, we do love that duck pride, don't we? Shade says, no, it seems fine to me. It's not game breaking. Well, you got that right. It hasn't technically broken anything. Oh no, Fawn in chat, in-game chat. Oh dear, RIP Fawn. I'm so sorry. 
Fawn is uh, also streaming and was hoping to get an X raid. Well, I'm sorry. Didn't mean to, you know, sneak into Asuma's consciousness and force him to make that decision. I'm sorry. Is that a little too sarcastic? It wasn't meant to be sarcastic. Oh well. Hope you're having a good stream. Not sure if you can hear me or not, but I hope you're having a good stream either way. Pinky Bear says, I wonder if Duck Pride is a thing other than for you. You know what? I'm convinced it's not. But that's okay. We can make it a thing. Happy Wednesday to you. Oh. Whoops, there we go. Oh, do we have a trident fella throwing tridents? Right. Get out of here. Didn't even drop the trident. Oh. Can you believe it? He didn't even drop the trident. If you're going to throw it at me, you might as well give it to me, right? Oh, she's always out of sand. Oh, this lack of sand is going to make me angry, peeps. Let's just turn that off for now. So we can focus. Can we focus? Pinky Bear says, like, what if it is like gay pride, but with ducks? Well, I mean, you know, ducks have every right to be, you know, whatever they want to be, right? Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. Where's this music going? This playlist is a little bit crazy. Shade says the casual trident's flying by. This is fine if it kills him. Yeah, actually it is. Because on this server, if you didn't know already, this server is slightly enhanced, let's call it that, from the vanilla experience. So one of the things that we have on top of, you know, everything else that we get from it, that X already mentioned, such as resettable monuments and mansions and all that jazz trophies and stuff like that as well. One of the things we do enjoy here is keep inventory so I don't worry too much about the tridents also I didn't even notice them so there's also that okay it's going out so we have to round that back in towards the island Place that block wrong. There we go. Perfect. Oh goodness me. Get wrecked. It's like Halloween over here. They're coming out. All the ghouls and the spooks coming out from the depths. Ah, 
I hear another one. Pyro Burnham should pyro burn them. Sorry, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said that. I only say that because he's around here somewhere. You can see it on my cheaty map. Pinky Bear says, Binky, did you read the in-game chat? I have read some of it. And I'm currently reading it. I'm probably behind. I'm absolutely terrible at following it. Sawi. Alright, we're, we're bringing this back in. There we go. Beautiful. Power Burnham says, ah, oh, dang it. Yes. Dang it indeed. Dang it for what, sorry? Hey, stop it. Pinky Bear says, King said that it isn't keep inventory in your in-game chat. Um, well, I'm pretty sure we have keep inventory on. I, I suppose I could prove it. I could prove it. Burnham says it's technically keep inventory. Right. Yes. That is what the game rule is called. Pyro also says there's just a thing in place to wipe your levels. Yeah. So yes, we do lose our levels when we die, if we die. And that is simply because uh, we needed to offset the obvious somewhat cheaty benefit of having our inventory not completely deleted when we die which I think is perfectly fair right let's do that shade says you don't need to prove it Okay. Well, you know, death will come for me eventually. Especially when it's nighttime. Those phantoms. Oh my goodness, those phantoms. They come out here and they try and troll, you know? Boda Fan YT has followed. Thank you very much for the follow. Hope you're having a fantastic day. And M Pickle 3 has also followed. I'm quite behind on that one. Thank you very much for the follow. Thank you indeed.
Botato fan. Okay, now that I've actually read it properly, that does make sense. Asking in chat, am I able to know the game IP? Uh, yes and no. What I can tell you is um, this is a whitelisted server. So the way you get whitelisted is by going to assumavoid.com. And on the left side of his website, there will be an option to get whitelisted on the server. And um, yeah, that's that's how you that's how you get the uh, the IP for the server. Thank you very much, Jimbo, for posting that information for us. Tom, 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 what are you doing in my chat? Are you trolling in the game? Are you invisible? Tom's always showing up everywhere invisible. Oh, those invi invisibility potions he's got. Endless supplies of those. Yeah. Right, let's do that. Sure. I don't know where this is going. But once we take a step back and take a look, we'll find out. Botato fan. Is a fan of Botatoes. YouTube potatoes. Jimbo was over here clearing up the kelp. But I, I think I know why he stopped. Probably started killing his frames. Right. Okay, that works. No rhyme or reason, peeps. We're just dropping sand and dirt wherever it seems to... Wherever my mind seems to want to put it. And that's good enough for me. Here we go. So I don't really have much of a plan other than terraforming. I have been procrastinating this for quite a while already, so it's time to get a little bit caught up.
Oh, Dolphin's Grace. I have yet to find a use for Dolphin's Grace. Can someone tell me if you found a use for Dolphin's Grace? Well, other than, you know, underwater dolphin highways. We actually have one. Me and Jimbo built one between the two of our bases. Bear wants to know, what country do you live in, Binky? <clears throat> Voice crack. Oh my goodness. I currently live in the UK. But I am from Canada. Because it wasn't super obvious that I'm not, you know, from the UK. Because I know I sound exactly the same. As X and Mumbo. Howard Burnham says, you can't call that tiny tunnel a highway. Excuse me. Okay, you know what? Then... Right, well, let's call it... What are we going to call it? Oh, I need to eat. There. We're full. Give us that dolphin's grace. World's longest dolphin highway, if you ask me. Uh-oh. We lost it, peeps. Oh, there it is. Cat's in the water. Oh, dear. Okay, so we're actually getting pretty close to finishing this up. At least on this small little island. And then I've got to go and do the main island over there and then don't even get me started on this big monstrosity oh goodness me so my plan is to build a some sort of mountain I guess to cover this up and then I will move all the farms from over there we got a chorus farm sugar cane farm and prickly cacti farm move those in here somewhere there's also a whole bunch of slime chunks in there so maybe we'll do something with the slime chunks. And then I can hide all of that lovely industrial industrialness inside of a uh, volcano or perhaps a mountain. And yes, that is a guardian farm. That box right there. Sort of copy decks. Sorry about it. Power Burnham says nothing. Says nothing. Okay. Power Burnham had no good suggestions. Okay, that's good. Very good. Just kidding. Pyro says you should add struts to the tube to not make it look like it's perfectly floating in the middle of the water. Slightly paraphrased. Yeah, that's that's the plan. Yep, that's the plan. We will get to that eventually. The struts will start at the entrances, but we're not 100% sure, well at least I'm not, about how this entrance is going to connect to this island. Still working on it.
Well, soon, soon, eventually, maybe someday soon, you know. Maybe never. Jimbo's so busy working on 20 million different projects. So we haven't had a chance to link up to finish that tunnel. Didn't mean to do that. Assume it in game. Welcome to the Let's Play Minecraft Together. Let's play the Minecraft together, peeps. Pinky Bear says the speed tube. Yes, it is a speed tube. We go speeding down the tube. What else would you call it if not a dolphin highway? The dolphin, well, I guess the dolphin speed tube. The dolphin mini express. Or the dolphin speeds you on his way speeds you on your way. It doesn't speed you on the dolphin's way. That doesn't make sense. Why would the dolphin speed you on his own way? The dolphin's not going anywhere. He's in a minecart. Shade says the dolphin tunnel run. Sounds good to me. Oh, and do tell how terribly interesting it is to watch a duck underwater, dressed as a cat, terraforming an island. It must be the most fascinating thing. You didn't even realize you would be doing this the evening. And to think you could have missed out. Oh my goodness, wouldn't that have been something... So turning off the in-game chat didn't seem to work, did it? Right. Um, doesn't matter. Let's just turn it back on. Went commands only, but um, hmm. it was still showing it. Whatever. Buggy game be buggy. Pinky Bear says, okay, sorry, I gotta go. I'll be back later. Oh, sorry. I'll be back. You aren't boring. <laughs> uh, no, that's fine. You take care of Pinky Bear. Take care of Pinky Bear's business. Not sure where I'm going with that statement. Have a good day. Have a good... What's he saying? What is this? What is he saying? Have a good something. Tongue-tied. I've had a long day, okay? Don't judge me. Just trying to sit here and have a nice little chill stream. I'm gonna get all this judgment. Oh my goodness, peeps. Oh. This, this damn, this, oh goodness me. All this kelp. Can you see what you've done, Jimbo? Making me deal with all this kelp? Yes, okay, so now let's, that's gonna be fun, joining it up to that. I guess we'll just fill it in and make it work however it works. And not worry too much about it. I'm also quite a bit less talkative than I usually am. I'm not the most talkative person on streams, which is a bit strange, right? Because you would expect a streamer to have, you know, quite a lot to say. That's half the stream, isn't it? Well, you know, sometimes you just have to have a nice chill stream where you're just hanging out. 
Not thinking about too much, just doing some terraforming. Spangle Boo says, Naughty Jimbo. Yes, Naughty Jimbo. Not clearing away that kelp. I couldn't have said it better myself. I think he needs a Naughty Jimbo emote or whatever. Naughty Jimbo teehee. Or I guess it wouldn't be a teehee, it would just be a Naughty Jimbo, wouldn't it? OG with the host. The original. Thank you very much for the host. Hope you're having a wonderful life. Let's go with that. Since I don't know where you are, don't know what time of day it is. We'll just go with that. Oh, yep. Okay, that works. Just do that. Perfect. <laughs> Shade0124 says, Jimbo, you could go and help if you're able. I believe Jimbo is able. I don't think Jimbo's frames are able. Clearing the kelp, it does kill the frame rate a little bit, doesn't it? Jimbo says, I'm doing 20 million different projects, as Binky just said. Uh, yes. Busy Jimbo. Did I say 20 million? It's probably close to it, to be honest. To be completely honest with you. Twenty million different projects. I wouldn't be surprised. How's it going, Spangle? Shade says, it crashed my Xbox, so I mean, they do drop frames on an Xbox. This is a funky song, I like it. Pyro says, what do you mean they drop frames? They drop kelp. Oh, you're funny. He's a comedian, peeps. Jimmy says, drop frames, not bombs. I agree. But you know what? We should drop even more than both of those. We should drop candy. Because I like candy. Jimbo. Uh-oh, Sherpa fell out of the world. Oh my goodness, look at this. It's an invasion. Yes, one drowned counts as an invasion, okay? Ow. Rude. I feel like this music is insanely loud. Can somebody tell me in chat, how's the music? If 
feel like I ask this every single stream. I'm still trying to figure out the audio balance here. Come on, there we go. Watch somebody tell me the music's not loud enough. It's literally blaring in my ears. I gotta find a better setup. Spangle Boo says it's fine to me. Well, damn it, Spangle. I'm supposed to say it's too loud. Thanks, but no thanks. Don't want your kelp. Return to sender. Return to sender, please, and thank you. Spangle says sorry. Well, you know what? I'm not sure if I believe that. Do I believe it? I don't think I do. Oh, that Jimbo. He is launching all kinds of fireworks now, isn't he? Underwater fireworks, Jimbo. Dolphin is chatty. How you doing, Mr. Dolphin? How's servitude? How's that working out for you? Disclaimer, it wasn't my idea to build this tunnel. I am not privy to this cruelty. Oh, I like this song. I'm gonna have to make a note of this one. It's got some tropical vibe to it. Mm. Uh oh, smack the microphone. Professional streamer, smack the microphone. Go wait fall by approaching Nirvana. You know what? I'm starting to like approaching Nirvana and I don't even know who they are. This is not a pre-made playlist, by the way. This is well and truly a random playlist. Ah, uh, that's just, they're all on the same level. Need some, need some variety here. There we go. Oh, now the next one. Oh. Can't win. Right, well, we'll come back and work on the details later. Start working on the details. I'm going to start feeling like X doing redstone on live streams. The whole world is judging. The whole world is watching. Don't make a mistake. Oh, you don't want to make a mistake. Crazy Marf has joined the game. You know he's going to be doing Crazy Marf things. With his Crazy Marf self. Shade says, where did it all go wrong? I wish I knew. I think it went wrong when they voted Trump. That's just what I think.
Oh, okay. Who's this then? What song is this? Waves of Innocence by Aphelion. Well, I'll be saving that one. Go on then. Get in my playlist. Shade says, I think it went wrong when they printed Jace, the mini sculpture in MTG. I'm sorry, I don't know what any of those words mean. Those words elude me. Oh, goodness. Okay, so we got to think about the entrance here. And we are definitely not doing that on stream. Oh, that is a doozy, isn't it? Hmm. Oh, MTG, Magic the Gathering. Shows how much I play that game, doesn't it? Oh, goodness. Stop it. Please stop. Oh, no. See why that dolphin is locked up? He's a terrorist. Just a terrorist. Garth, he's griefing. Garth is one of the moderators in the server. So what's everybody up to? Surely if you're still here, you're not glued to the screen like this is the most incredible thing you've ever seen on Minecraft. If anything, I imagine some of you got this going on in the background. Darling Emma has followed. Oh, I thank you, Darling Emma, for the follow. Hope you're having a wonderful day. And if you're not, I am sorry to hear that. I hope it turns around for you. Spangle says, listening to you and playing Two Point Hospital. Well, that's a game. I'm I'm sure of that. If you asked me to tell you more than that, I'm not sure if I could. And Shay says, nah, it's what I'm watching right now. Oh, well, there you go. Getting some good ideas for your, your duck island. Underwater terraforming. <laughs> yes, you're building a duck island now. It's not a debate. BuzzD9691 has followed. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the Quack family. That sounded a bit angry, didn't it? 
Welcome to the stream, and thank you very much for the follow. Spangle says, it's a game about a hospital. I knew it. Get wrecked, Jared. Get wrecked. Get absolutely wrecked. Who is this duck? Why is he so mean? Always telling the moderators to get wrecked. Can you believe this guy? Unbelievable. Jimbo, what are you up to? What are you doing there? Just floating around? Shade says, I have no controller at the moment. Did Jimbo take it? Jimbo, where'd you put the controller? See that? He's scarpered. He's off hiding it somewhere now. Did we go over the top of that one? Nah, that's fine. Uh-oh. There's some violence in the staff. Staff on staff. Hate crime. Shade says, yeah, he stashed it in the tunnel. Somewhere. Yeah. I wouldn't be surprised, to be completely honest. Oh, we got a baby. We got a baby drowned. Oh, what? Well, that was awesome. I lost my trident. There it is. You know, they're babies. You should never hit babies with tridents. That's why I didn't. I would never. Right then. Get wrecked. Don't hit babies with tridents. Unless that baby's name is Cuddles. Cuddles the bear. I feel like that's a reference for literally one person. Bangaboo says, thanks for the advice. I was just aiming my trident at a baby. I'll stop. You know, it's like I said. If that baby's name is Cuddles, then you carry on. Get out of here. Get lost. Get all the way lost. Okay, you know what? I say we block this completely, and then we can figure out the entrance after we've got the overall shape here. Because this is going to have to be shaped up anyways. So, we might as well. What's with these invisible peeps? Always trolling my streams, eh? TD, you see what we've started? TD, 47976782455. In-game. This is a tradition that he started. It's his fault. Oh, wait. Don't start griefing me again. Or else Garth's going to ban you for life. Get wrecked. Shade in chat with the wide eyes. That about sums it up, doesn't it? Oh 
no. Do you mind? Oh, we got some visual glitching. Okay. Oh, okay. Now you're a shulker box. Right. Let's let's go to this side. I don't know why I started this side and then never finished it. I guess it's because once you start doing something like this, your process changes. Like, oh, that's so much more dirt blocks than I needed to place. Yeah, okay, so the only reason I'm actually cleaning it up underneath here is because I am sort of going for a look here. Once I drain all the water out, I don't want to see giant clumps of dirt. I mean, we could also just cover it with other blocks, but I also kind of like the idea of just seeing how it would look just as it is. I think that would look cool. And I guess we're going to find out when that happens, if it looks cool or not. Right. they say about spangle boo Have you done something wrong, Spangle? Are you being a naughty Spangle? Perfecto el mundo. Yes, there we go. Getting rid of some dirt. Bangaboo says, no, I am lovely. Spangle is pretty lovely. Most of the time. When she's not being naughty. for that. Sometimes you hit the wrong dirt block. All the sand comes crashing down. Or you go into automated swim mode. It's because you double tap the direction keys a little too quickly and go into swim mode and then you get disoriented.
Didn't happen, you didn't see it. It didn't happen. TD4797, did the meeting fall out then? It usually does. They had a staff meeting today after Exa's stream. And it looks like um, Sherpa and Garth might have had a little bit of disagreements. Oh, Garth and Jared. I'm pretty sure Sherpa was involved a minute ago. Maybe not. Maybe I'm incriminating someone. I'm... I'm... Yeah. Well then. Shut up, duck. I'm having difficulty with words today, if you hadn't noticed. If you hadn't noticed. Geo Carrero. Okay, yep. I 100% butchered that says hi hello to you and please excuse me while i butcher the crap out of your name so sorry after all we are wearing a cat's head today we're wearing i louve cat's head so if you're offended you can go ahead and talk to him about it just be like you know what i louve cats I didn't like what you said to me on that stream. I don't like your attitude, Mr. Katz. Mr. Katz, why must you say these things to me? Because well, I love Katz. It's just naughty, isn't he? Just a bad kitty. We'll have to fix that. Although we are draining all of this out eventually, so maybe it's not that big of a deal. And really, I don't think it is. I Louvre Cats is a moderator on the server, so it's not like I made this person up, just saying. They made themselves up. on the Let's Play Minecraft Together server. Where we play Minecraft together. Who knew? What a concept. character right here for a second. Peeps, I will be right back. I need to go check up on something really quick.
And we're back just in time to get wrecked. Uh oh. Let's do the off. We're out of here. What a welcome back that was. Look at all these tridents. I throw tridents better than you do, bro. Come at me. Spangle Blue says, welcome back. Thank you ever so much. Glad to be back. I feel like it's been a lifetime. Peeps, has it been a lifetime? Everyone's like, heck no, not long enough. Oh, I think my, my doge. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. I like that. You can just chill out there. I bet he was coming to my rescue. Pinky Bear says, what happened since I had to go? You know, not a whole lot. Um, just doing some terraforming, you know. Just cleaning up this massive amounts of dirt underneath so that it doesn't look quite as janky when we go to drain out all the water. Pink Vampire has followed. Thank you very much and welcome to the stream and welcome to the Quack family. Glad to have you here with us, hanging out, doing some terraforming. Underwater terraforming, no less. Goodness me. Underwater terraforming. Who would do such a thing? Who even knew such a thing needed to be done? Pinky Bear says, are you at the same area as before? Nope. No, we are at the front. Oh my goodness, they are out in full force today, these chaps. Ow, rude. Don't throw those at me, that is rude. Okay, well, let's see if we can get those guys to chill out for a little while. Right, so this is the front of the island. You know what, why don't we just surface for a second? And you can see what I mean. Ah, right, there we go. Right, so that's my nether portal, obviously. So yeah, this is, I guess, technically the front of the island. And where we were when we started was at the back of the island. Classic. He says he's going to get out of the water, he's going to surface for a second and show people around, and he doesn't even do that, can you? Unsub. Unfold. Click away, peeps. Can't trust this one. Glitchy block. Glitchy block. Fair enough. Yeah, those Trident fellas are out in full force tonight. Yeah, so this is the main island. The island we started at is at the back. It's technically a separate island. It's a bit of a smaller island. And uh, so this one is the main island where I have my temple over here, which was the most recent build on the island so far. It's just a place where I store my mementos, like players' heads, people that I, you know, viciously murder on the server for their heads. And a floating village where I've got random people from the server coming over and let's, you know what, let's go check it out. You know what, let's, peeps, let's get to the flying. Get to the flying. Right. Floating village for my villagers, the ones that are not worth trading with. 
So those will go in here and it'll just become like a village for them to live in. Oh, we got a pack spawn of squiddies. Is there like no one on the server? Things are spawning like crazy. Yeah, and then these two buildings here are like the trading halls, I guess. It's where I'm storing the good villagers. Hence the rail. The janky rail, which is missing a powered rail for some reason. To deliver the the fun traders who trade the fun things to the fun house. Right, let's get back to business. Sla Plays has followed. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Nope, that's the wrong block. There we go. Yeah, I feel like if we just did it... Actually, if we did it this way, it might be... Less blocks being placed and then replaced, you know? Just start down here. Pinky Bear says, those two long buildings kind of remind me of Native American log houses, typically used by tribes like the Iroquois, 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 in northeastern United States. Yeah, that's a good point. I suppose so. Sure, I'll take it. Sounds good to me. going on here what are you doing oh what are you doing he said he could place blocks he did he said he was good at placing blocks didn't he oh but that almost matches up quite nicely we do need to make a slight adjustment just an ever so slight adjustment oh my goodness it's the mouse wheel. The mouse wheel, middle click the, the mouse wheel and it pick, it does the pick block, the picking of the blocks and stuff. And then I also end up scrolling it at the same time, which just scrolls it to the block I just had, which is not convenient for me. So yay for that. Yay for that. Oh, it happened again. Spangle, it happened again. Apple Pie has joined the game. Well, now every time he joins the game, I just get hungry. I could eat a whole apple pie right now. Yeah, let's get a little bit of variety in here. Oh my goodness, these guys just keep coming, don't they? They just keep on coming. They don't stop. They don't know when to stop. I'm 
Shade says, what happened? That happened. That's what keeps happening. This pick block is, is betraying me today. It's trying to play me like a fool. It's saying, you know what? Get tricked, Minecrafter. I'm not going to perform like I should. And you know what? You know what I say to that? I say, that is not very nice, Minecraft function. You are supposed to work. You are a coded game. How dare you not work? Pinky Bear says, there's a store near where I live that has two frozen pies, two frozen apple pies even, for $5. US, I assume? What an assumption. What an assumption to make, right? That sounds pretty good. Either way, that sounds like a pretty good deal to me. Slap one of those in the oven, or both. And then uh, some ice cream. Man, that sounds pretty good. Okay, I see. So it comes out a bit here. Right. Let's let's carry on here then. This is so much fun. It's actually not. Well, I mean, it, it kind of is. It's relaxing. It's not the most entertaining thing to spend my time doing, but it's got to get done. And you know what? The fact that I'm streaming it as well and derping about on the Twitch, it's making it a little bit more interesting for myself. And I'm finding myself looking at the progress. I'm like, oh, wait a second. That's not too bad. So that's a plus. Uh-oh. 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 bear says they're pretty large too the pies I assume sorry there was probably a bit too much delay when I said your name and then read out your comment It's all Spangles fault, isn't it? I wouldn't be mad at you if you blamed Spangle. Right, let's drop a sand block there just to give it a little bit of variety. Pinky Bear says, now I want pie. Yeah. Welcome to the club, Pinky Bear. Spangles says, I'm innocent. Shade says, Spangles did nothing wrong. Oh, goodness me. Side in with the Spangle. Not bad, not bad. Do have to fix this stuff in just a little bit to, to have it meet up there, but that's fine. Right.
Brilliant. Shade says, well, maybe. I'm going to be honest, I'm new to X and your streams, so I'm new to the community. Generally not a bad idea to side with Spangle. At least then she won't kill you. And welcome to the community. Hope you love it as much as I do. See if we can fix that ever so slightly. Hmm. You know what? Good enough. Spangaboo says, "Good advice, Pinky." Yeah, I'm, I'm giving good advice, but also s sort of not wanting to die. Don't kill the binky. Oh, he's going to come and... Oh, he's coming for me. Uninvited. Don't come back. Pinky Bear says, Welcome to the community, Shade. Hope you enjoy it enough to stick around. It's a nice comment. Jimbo says, I like Pinky. Pinky likes you too. So I find myself always getting disoriented when I go into F5. I do my thing here and then I come back here and I'm like, wait a second, where am I? Get out of here, my goodness. Stop growing so fast. That's right. We just gotta get rid of it at the root or else the problem just keeps on coming back. Shade says, I plan on sticking around with you guys' streams, your guys' streams, even. They're fun. Well, I'm glad you think so. They're fun for me. I'm pretty new to streaming myself, actually. Started streaming maybe two weeks ago. Getting some sand. It's a good time when I'm a bit more talkative and when I can actually say words without like confusing people with my dyslexia. That's not how dyslexia works. Who is this guy? What is this troll? Bengal loves duckies. Duckies are pretty cute. Oh, 
Oh, that Garth, he's in cheaty mode. Why am I not surprised? Spangaboo says, I love naughty Jimbos too. Do you? Don't encourage him. Let's drop a few bits of sand here and there, right? That's fine. Perfect. Is it perfect? Well, no. In fact, it's not, and that's the way it should be. Because if it's perfect, well then, you have done it wrong. And that's just my thought on it. It's my opinion. That's a duck's opinion. And yes, I've already explored that. There's nothing in there. Jimbo says, draw me a naughty Jimbo then. Please. Spangle says, maybe. Maybe, maybe, just maybe. Maybe if you're naughty enough. That's not where that goes. Thank you. Thank you. Try again. Usually it's thank you, come again. Never mind. You know what? Never mind. We're not going there. Okay, you know what? Yeah, I'll just bring that up to there. I like it. Jimbo. What's Jimbo up to? Where are you, Jimbo? Oh, Pinky Bear is throwing riddles at me. Right, let's break it down, peeps. Pinky Bear says, Binky, you told Spangle not to encourage him, yet you just said if he was naughty enough... He'd be drawn. Are you encouraging him to be naughtier? Um, I am genuinely confused. Well, I'll say this. There's no point telling Jimbo not to be naughty because he's going to be naughty anyways. Pinky says, not a riddle. Well, then I'm easily confused. Cool. Cool, cool. It's getting there. There's only about another 600 million more hours to go on this, but hey, you know what? We'll get there in a minute. In the end, eventually. Shade asks, are you going to put some sandstone slabs on the back when it's done? Could very well do. Yeah, I started this and got about halfway through the back part of the island and then realized I should have used something other than dirt. 
Because at some point I will have to... Yeah, now i got to think about that. That's... Yeah, I don't know about that. Because I don't want it to be dirt. But if I remove the dirt, then i got to come back up here and put more sand on. And yeah, it's just going to be a... A fun job, I suppose. I'm kind of... Letting that be tomorrow Binky's problem, but not literally tomorrow. Future Binky's problem. There we go. Let future Binky worry about that. No. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. Shade says, I see it now. If I was able to help... Oh, sorry. Messed that up. I read about as well as a duck. If I was able to join, I'd try and help. Appreciate that. Just a normal thing that normal people do. Pinky has a question that I will read in a second. I have a question for you, Binky. You don't have to answer if you don't want to, but how old are you? Ah, how old is Binky? Well, I always follow that up with saying, how old do you think I am? I probably sound older than I am, or maybe I sound younger than I am. I don't know. Subjective, really, isn't it? I'm timeless. Are you asking me that because I don't know how to speak English? He says, no, I was just wondering. Okay. I'm 12. No, no, that was a troll. Definitely not 12. Shade says he sounds like he is in his 20s, but I feel like he's younger than 18. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, I am 29 years old. So I guess I'll take that as a compliment. I mean, it's no fun to keep people guessing all night, right? They gotta know if they've guessed it right or wrong eventually.
Shade says, Oh, sorry, I'm not that good at guessing ages because I have a high pitchy voice at my age. Okay. I do not mind at all. It's sort of an impossible thing to ask somebody to guess, really. I mean, any guessing game is sort of the same. It is always going to come down to, you know, it's subjective. Everyone has a different idea of what sounds young versus what sounds old. And in the end, it doesn't really matter. So there you go. What did you get curious? Curious about what um, others' interpretations are. It's human curiosity, I suppose. Pinkies, pinky, pinky, pinky. <laughs> Sorry, one sec. Pinky Bear said, My thing lags so much I had to refresh, so I don't know what your answer was, but I'll watch it back. Okay, well, you can watch it back if you want to, but I can tell you as well. I'm 29. Twitchy be twitchy. Twitchy be twitchy. Twitch be twitchy. Twitchy, twitch, twitchy. What? Where's he going with this? Where's he lined in the plane? Nobody knows. He's lost his marbles. No, I feel like that needs actually to be one block higher. Good, good. Pinky Bear says, cool, you sound younger. Thank you. I think. I always take it as a compliment. Oh, goodness. Stop it. Stop doing that. Actually, that does work fine there. That's good. Pinky Bear says, people always tell me I look and sound older than I am. Well, I don't consider that a bad thing either. I have my own perceptions on getting older and how it makes me feel or, you know, how it makes me kind of understand where things are going. Is this becoming a deep conversation, peeps? I think we're being trolled. Getting downright philosophical now. Who's throwing tridents? Also, what's the naughty emote spangle? Is that just... What does that one look like? Emotes on the Discord server, by the way, if you're slightly lost. Spangle likes to make emotes for people. It's 
Spangle says, I have never made one. <laughs> Shade says, the music doesn't really go with the conversation, but it is good. Really good. I like to put my own spin on things that I read, apparently. Putting words in people's mouths. Yeah, the music is good, but yeah, it's... It's supposed to be a chill playlist, but I'm not finding it to be that chill, if I'm honest. Well, I mean, how chill is any song made by the artist called Gunfight gonna be, right? I mean, if that's your artist's name, come on. You know what you're getting into when you get into that one. If you're hearing slimes, it's because we have a slime, uh, slime farm right there. Well... Slime chunk down there. Bubble elevator brings him up. You know the drill. Um, maybe. You can see the recent song list on my Twitch profile. It's a boy moxa. Probably butchered that, didn't I? Says hello. Hello to you as well. And welcome to the stream. It's ya boy. Oh, now I get it. It's your boy, Moxa. Wants to know, what's your name? My... Oh, we're restarting the server, peeps. My in-game name is Binky Quack. My IRL name is Jasper. Fortnite for life says hello. Hello, Fortnite for life. Welcome to the stream. Nas Love has followed. Thank you very much for the follow. And welcome to the stream. We're at the two hour mark, but to be completely honest, I'm not in any rush to stop streaming. So maybe we'll just go for a little bit. It's your boy Moxa says, Hi Jasper, I love watching your channel. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. And I'm glad you love watching my channel. What's going on here? There we go. Hyper Jimbo says, Welcome to the Quack family. Yes, welcome to the Quack family. Anna Mango one says hi. Hello. Welcome to the stream. Or maybe you've been here the whole time. Who knows? Fortnite for Life says, Can you please give my disabled brother a shout out? His name is Jimmy. Jimbo, get in this one. Shout out to Jimmy. Much love from the Quack family. Not what we meant to do. Yes, Mr. Jimbo down there. Hyper Jimbo in Twitch chat. His name is also Jimmy. So they certainly share that in common. Pinky Bear says, Oh my god, I never would have imagined you as Jasper. I love that name. I was thinking you sound more like a Kevin or Oliver. Well, thank you. I probably would have been fine with Kevin or Oliver. I like Oliver. That's a nice name. It's Mumbo Jumbo's name. Or is his name just Ollie? I don't know if it's short for Oliver. It might not be. 
Fortnite for life says thank you. He's smiling now. Well, that is that is excellent. I'm glad to hear that. Fortnite for life also says he was crying now, but he's so happy. Thanks so much. Anytime, my friend. Oh, he's gone invisible again, peeps. Look at this. Can you see him? Just a floating banner. Pinky Bear says it's Oliver. Talk about mumbo jumbo. Okay, good to know. Shade says, wait, Mumbo's name is Ollie? Question mark, question mark. Yes, it is. It certainly is. FTB Maniac 4044 says, fell asleep watching Asuma's stream. Woke up here. What year is it? It's a relatively similar year to when it was when you fell asleep. But yeah, X went and raided me, so y'all have been watching me doing a little bit of under underwater terraforming here at my island. FTB Maniac says, super chill stream, though. Yeah, that was kind of my goal today. I don't really have a lot to talk about today, and really only came on here to stream. I don't know, it just felt like streaming, and the only thing I really had a plan to work on was the underwater terraforming. Something I've been quite behind on. Finally wanted to get caught up somewhat on that, so here we are. It's your boy Moxa says, Jasper, please, will you make a MC of me, a oh, with me, for my new track on Discord? Um, I don't know what that means. Do you mean make a Minecraft video? Naughty kelp. Killing Jimbo's frames. That's what you get for playing on a MacBook. FTB Maniac has followed. Thank you very much for the follow. Glad to have you with us today. Fresh, fresh, fresh out of shout outs. Shout out to all the peeps. Shout out to Spangle for being Spangly. Oh, 
Oh, goodness me. Now it's not what we meant to do at all, is it? Yeah, this is another weird thing that was introduced on the server recently. Now you can put things in your on your head. Oh, it's hat, right. Right, we have a door on our head. It's not as entertaining as I thought it would be. I already messed up that prank. Never mind. I knew I heard you somewhere. I knew it. You're sneaking up on me. Yeah, shout out to Binky. Oh, that's not my spoon. Opinions on Stampy says Fortnite for life. No opinions. I don't know what that is. Great, that looks good. Pinky Bear wants to know what does a trident look like on your head? Well, let's see. Oh, okay. I guess it looks like that. It's a little bit strange. I'm gonna put my Iluv cat's head back on in case I get into trouble. Then I can blame it on Iluv cats. That cats, he's too busy louving cats, he can't ever follow the rules. The rules on the server. Shade wants to know, can we wear X or spangles on our head? You know, I think so. If you were to join the server and find Spangle and ask her nicely if you could chop her head off, she might be willing to let you do that. As for X, well, you know, not so sure about that one. He's pretty busy. He's busy being British and stuff. FTB Maniac says, do you have a Minecraft niche, 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 or a specialty? Um, you know, I don't know. Not really, I guess. Underwater terraforming. There we go. I guess we could simplify the question as like, are you a builder or a redstoner? And I would say I'm a bit of both. Though more of a builder than a redstoner, only because my understanding of redstone is basic in comparison to some hardcore redstoners, I suppose. There you go, Jimbo can wear X's head. Yep.
yeah, player heads drop when you kill another player on the server. It's sort of a PvP bonus, I guess. It also drops if you kill yourself. So there's that. FTB Maniac was gonna mention... Was just gonna mention the terraforming looks clean. Thank you very much. Hopefully not too clean. It's meant to look a bit... Um, I don't know, what would be the word? Underwatery? <laughs> Great way to describe it, my friend. Great way to describe it. Well, you know, it's meant to look like some currents have come and done their thing. Washing away some sand and all that jazz, so, you know. And then, of course, we're not just going to leave it as sand. There's going to be... Um, gravel mostly near the bottom will bring some gravel up into the into the sand and yeah mix it up a little bit there and then throw some bits of gravel randomly throughout as well i think that would look good ib gaming 101 youtube is hosting me thank you very much for the host oh that's the wrong block there be placing doors. I be gaming 101 YouTube also wants to know, can I play with you? You know, I would encourage you to do so. However, it is a whitelisted server, so you know, got to go through the 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 process to get whitelisted and then yeah, you can play with me and you can play with Jimbo and you can play with everyone else on the server. There you go, Jimbo's posted some information in the chat for you. Thank you, Jimbo. I be gaming 101 with another noise in my ear. Following us on the Twitch. Dot TV slash the Binky the Quack. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the Quack family. The Quack Familia. I mean, geez, with these tridents. Where is it now? I'm not even trident farming. What are you doing here? Ouch. Haven't seen any phantoms, though. Is it because I've got water above me? I thought they still spawn. Get wrecked. Pinky Bear says, thanks Jimbo. I was gonna ask if I could put that info in chat. Yeah, you're certainly welcome to. If you do exclamation point LPMT, I think. Maybe I should have made that a little bit easier. If you do LPMT, then Nightbot will come in and throw some information at your face about how to get on the server. It's not my server. This is um, one of the servers in the Assumiverse, Assumavoids fan base, community base. Yeah, this is looking a bit too even. Let's let's shake it up a little bit. Oh, hello. He's wearing a binky head. Jimbo says a rare binky head. Indeed.
imposter. <laughs> imposter as he puts Iluth Katz's head back on. Get out of my life, dang it. I don't want it. No more kelp. Shade says, shh. No one will find out your true identity if he has your head on. I'm in cat -nido. Oh my god, with the puns. Can you even believe it? Get it? In cat -nido? Lol, 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 No. It was pretty bad. I'm sorry. Why are we placing doors? Organize thy inventory. Yes, there we go. That's a little bit better, isn't it? I don't really know where this is going. It's going right there. Shade says, now we have a rare binky cat in its natural habitat. That we do. Oh, goodness me. Can I just place the right block? Oh, my goodness. One lonely bit of sand? Yeah, maybe we'll just change it up a little bit. Don't want it to all be grass, right? It can be a little bit of sand here and there. I'll come back and worry about that later. Mike Sterner has followed. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a wonderful day. I'm going to guess day. We're just going to leave that sand there because I don't really care. It's not where that goes, but that's fine. This song has me confused. I don't really know where it's going. Lucius with the follow. Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream and welcome to the quack family. Oh, stop it. Just Oh, we're out of sand. Thank you for the follow. Dun dun dun. Yeah, this song is dramatic. I don't I'm not sure if it should be. Cuz it hasn't really reached a point yet.
Mike Sterner says, I'm surprised you only have 92 followers. You seem like the kind of streamer that would have thousands of followers. Goodness me, thousands of followers. Well, I'm glad you think so. It might have something to do with the fact that I've only been streaming for like two weeks. And two of those streams have been raided by X, Mr. Asuma Void. I'm not sure if he came from the X raid or not, but he well and truly has thousands of followers, so. You know, that helps. Appreciate the compliment. Get the sand in my inventory and then out of my inventory just as fast as it came. Jimbo says, welcome to the Quack family. Yes, welcome to the Quack family. Which is apparently what I'm calling my followers. I'm okay with it. Thank you, Jimbo, for protecting me. From the naughty, naughty, evil things that were not invited to the Quack family. Yet they show up anyways. Okay, I'm gonna need this song to, you know, make its point really fast, otherwise I have no idea what's going on. Did something just blow up on my island? Did I just hear an explosion? Hmm. Was that lightning? Oh, looks like Jimbo got a trident. I spawn proofed my island. Meticulously, so when I hear an explosion, I... I get a little bit confused because I never get spawns of really anything. Oh, there's some phantoms. Took them only about two and a half hours, but they finally showed up. Yes. It is a very... Actually, hold on a second. Hold on. Cheaty light overlay mode. Yeah, so things can actually spawn right here. Okay, let's fix that. Right on. He uses cheaty overlays. Unsubscribe. You didn't see it? Can't prove it. Didn't happen. Oh, goodness me. Where were we? Here we were. Mike Sterner asks, why does the seaweed have pink flowers on it? These ones? Um, it's a resource pack. And you can get it on uh, assumovoid.com. What is going on up there? Um, and so basically what it is, is that is an age 25 kelp. Right, so it's not going to grow any further than that. So you got to come down here and break it if you want it to grow taller. You need to get wrecked. Oh, yeah, we got a phantom head. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Shade says, I really enjoyed the stream so far. Well, thank you. I'm really glad you did. I have also been enjoying the stream. Doggos. Oh, okay. So there's sevens everywhere. My island is not as safe as I thought it was. But seriously, though, what's been exploding? Where is that exploding coming from, Jimbo? What are you doing? Shade says, you've been attacked by phantoms. Oh, those phantom butts. No, they don't know when to quit, do they?
and they do not know when to quit. I like this song. At least it's not confusing. Well, you know, maybe it's confusing to some. But it makes sense to me. Spangaboo says, it's getting late, Binkies, so I'm going. Enjoy the rest of your stream. Thank you very much, Spangle. Thank you for coming out. And just remember, if, if, if there was something that somebody needed to be blamed for, just blame it on I Louvre Cats. Moderator on the server. That's whose head I'm wearing right now. Bye, Spangle. Have a wonderful evening. for me. Oh, but this middle row is... Some, hmm. Sticks out, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay. Did I say I blame Jimbo? Who's blaming Jimbo? Oh, Spangleboo blamed Jimbo. Yeah, that's fine. Thought maybe I got confused when I was trying to blame it on Iluv cats. Ugh, just dropping sand everywhere. I Louvre cats. I don't know why, I just really like saying that. Again, for those who don't know, I Louvre Cat's one of the moderators on this server, so yeah. Not just some random name of some person that doesn't exist. FTB Maniac says, how long do you plan on streaming today? You know, it's been about two and a half hours. I'm getting kind of hungry, so I might wrap it up pretty soon. Time certainly does fly when you're doing something as intensely entertaining as underwater terraforming. You look back and you're like, where the heck did all that time go? All that time, it sure did escape us, didn't it? Jimbo says, Binky, eat before the next stream. Yes. Yeah, I gotta get into the habit of doing that. Pinky Bear says, do you love cats though, Binky? I like cats. I would say I don't like cats as much as I love cats likes cats. Because, I mean, he loves cats, you know. What do you think my favorite animal is? I'm kind of curious what people have to say about that. Let me, I'll, I'll give you a hint. It's not what you think it is. Just looking at the Twitch profile and you're like, you know what? I think I know what it is. FTB Maniac says, thanks for the entertainment. Looking forward to the next stream. Thank you very much. Glad you enjoyed it. That next stream is going to be tomorrow. Around the same time. 8 p.m. GMT. So, I'm not sure what time zone you're in or what time that means in your time zone, but you know what? You can always look it up on Google. Ghosts Fight 69 has followed. 
Thank you for the follow. Welcome to my stream. As well as Fernin Zero. Probably butchered your name, and if I did, let me know. Welcome to the Quack family, to the both of you. Yes, so with regards to keeping up to date on chat and noises, I do my best, but you know, I get distracted. Chances are I'll either get to it or somebody will tell me that I've forgotten to shout someone out who deserves a shout out and I'll try to fix that as quick as I can. So back to the favorite animal question. I've seen one person's answer. Oh, that was the sudden end to the song. My favorite animal is owls. Why did I hear a creeper sizzle? That was... Again, so there's creepers. It's you. What are you doing over here? Why are you... What, what are you doing, Jimbo? Why is there a redstone block here? Are you exploding TNT? Pinky Bear says, wow, I really like owls. Me too, I love owls. I think they're majestic. Jimbo, what are you doing? Cut it out. Ghosts fight 69 and says, dang it, not again. Dang it, not again. Oh, dang it, not again. Not again, not again. Shade says, I like owls too. I had a D&D &D character that had an owl as a pet. That is lovely. Oh, stop. Just stop. Piggy Bear says, I like how clever they are and resourceful. Again, I paraphrased it. But hey, that's what I do, isn't it? Yeah. Absolutely agree with you on that one. I, I think owls are uh, very clever. And survivors, so you know. Incredibly resourceful. And predatory, so you know. They gotta be resourceful, don't they? Ghost Fight 69 says, I wish I could join. Well, you know, you can. 
Pinky Bear with the uh, the message in chat from Nightbot for you to let you know what server I'm playing on and how you can also play on the same server. And then you could come and do some underwater terraforming. Who doesn't like to do a little bit of underwater terraforming, am I right? Right. So I think we'll finish off this corner, which will probably take a few minutes. And then uh, see where we go from there. Ghost Fight 69 says, can't afford Minecraft, which sucks. You know, I have to agree. I enjoy playing Minecraft. Terraforming. So, Pinky Bear, what's your favorite color? Is it pink? He says no actually when I was 10 it was okay Kazatron says how are you still streaming I don't know mate you tell me time flies I guess I'm getting kind of hungry though, so I might wrap it up in a few minutes. Unless you mean in general, then that I would say, who knows, man? Who knows? I mean, some people stream for, you know, 12, 12 hours, you know, so. Kazatron says, I just had pancakes, Shrove Tuesday. Hashtag Shrove Tuesday, even. Yeah, I heard about that this morning. I haven't had any pancakes today. I have the stuff to make pancakes. I suppose I could. Seems like the responsible thing to do when the day is dedicated to pancakes, isn't it? Jimbo's uh, swimming in the ground, I guess. Oh, hold on. I'm confused. I get so disoriented in that view. Right. There we go. See, this is one of the things I love about Minecraft is it's just such a derpy game. You can just do really dumb things. <laughs> Shade says, pancakes for dinner, question mark. 
absolutely. Pancakes for all the meals. Shade also says Jimbo.exe has crashed. Yeah, and Binky as well. Execute force quit. Control Alt Delete. Right, okay. Pinky Bear says, I think my mom is making pancakes for dinner tonight. Oh god, I hope so. Although I don't really know why I hope so. I'm not going to be able to have any of those pancakes. Ghost Fight 69 says, why me? Um, why me? Yeah. Yeah, why you? Why not you? Pinky Bear says, if there was a way I could share, I could electronically send you pancakes, I would. I appreciate it. I just thought that counts. Again, with the reading. Where does he get these words from? It's not even written. Putting words in people's mouths. Right, that's, that's it done for now. So we'll have to at some point come through and put a little bit of texture in here, some gravel. Just to give it a bit of a more realistic feel about it, you know? Yeah, still lots and lots and lots to go. Could do slabs. Could do some stone, uh, sandstone slabs. Maybe near the top with some actual, with some sandstone as well and bring the sand up past the grass a little bit as well. As well, as well, as well. Saying as well a lot apparently. Yeah, we could do that. Yeah, I can see that working. Some sandstone, sandstone stairs and uh, full sandstone blocks for a little bit of texture and variety. That could work quite well. Jimbo says, a giant sand mountain binky. Yeah. It is, isn't it? So let's see what it looks like from behind. As I mentioned earlier in the stream, I want to come through here eventually, drain out all the water, and then build some stuff under here. Possibly build my base under here. Who knows? Because there's all this space. And then basically all the all the space around the entire island and all of this junk in front of us could get dug out as well yeah it um, it's a lot of work but it's a concept thinking about it so we'll see where it goes but I think I'm gonna wrap the stream up here for now peeps Thank you very much everyone who followed and everyone who came and hung out with us tonight, this evening, this day, morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time it is, wherever you are in the world. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Thank you for hanging out with us while we terraformed. A whole lot of terraforming if you ask me. Shade wants to know, what is your plan for tomorrow? You know, tomorrow is an actual scheduled stream, so I might have a bit more of a plan. As of this moment, I don't have a plan. 
But you know what? I have an idea. So we'll see. Ghosts fight 69 says I barely get on here though. Well, that's fine. Don't even worry about it. You see the stream when you can see it. Thanks for coming out. Pinky Bear, hope you have a wonderful day. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for coming out, peeps.